and welcome to the Back Row Jamie Show. I just wanted to do an update video for y'all, so I am using my little ring thing on the back of my camera, and I'm just using my phone. So I want to do a quick one while I'm outside, so I'm sit and tell you my update. So I'm moving. Today's the last day that the people are occupying the apartment. These are my new sunglasses. Do you like them? I just wanted to show you my new sunglasses too. Um, this is the last day they're occupying my apartment. And my uncle thinks it's the one right, right next to him. So that's a plus. I'll have family really, really super close. So I won't have to worry if something happens. I'm just sitting here drinking one of these coffee drinks. These are really good coffee drinks. My dad gets us a couple of them once in a while. So I got one of those. And I am got my coffee mugs that I needed. I got a couch coming when I move. I got my couch. I got everything I need. I got a vacuum coming to me. I've got my chair that I've always had. I'm going to get rid of my coffee table. Um, I'm going to... My mom got me every little thing I needed. I needed a pot for um, cooking macaroni and cheese because mine was really worn out. And I wanted a, a stainless steel one, so she found one in her garage. She found me the Kool-Aid pitcher I needed. She found me some new utensils. And I, f I bought new coffee mugs at Dollar Tree for a dollar. One says, um, great idea, start with coffee. And another one says, um... Any time is a great time for coffee, and then no one says cap. Um, one says a uh, latte, and another one says cappuccino, and they're cute. And then I got um some pictures for my kitchen that are cafe style. So I thought those cups would go great with that. I'm just excited to move, and um. I'm sad at the same time, but I'm happy because I'm gonna have enough. Finally, gonna have enough money because I'm getting my so my disability to be able to live on my own without having to live here and being forced to stay because I. It's not that I hated living here. It's just that I can't have visitors come when I want and all that, and I can't have my friends come over that my sister don't know, and I can't say, "Hey, let's go back to my apartment and chill," like. It's that kind of thing. Like, if Crystal wanted to just come over and chill with me and Josh at my house, I can't really say, yeah, let's do that and all that. Or, hey, bring your kids over. We'll go swimming. Now I can have say, hey, Gracie, come over and go swimming, which is my niece. I took her out today, and I got her a bubble tea, a new phone case, and another um, charger cord for her own iPhone so she can um use the little power brick that I got her because I got her this little power brick me and my mom found a little power brick at a garage on it works and it's a Motorola one and it's got a cord that comes out but that's um Android for like my phone but it's a really nice charger and I know it's probably a decent it's probably like a little bit pricier of a one so it's going to be a good cord which I'm so excited, so she'll be able to charge her phone and she won't have to worry about her phone going dead if she keeps that charger co charged. She can charge it with the same thing she charges her um, iPod dock that I bought. Not iPod dock, um, um, Amazon Echo dot charge um, speaker thing that you put your Amazon Echo, in, Echo dot in. She's got an Echo dot too that I bought her for her birthday. Not this past birthday that she had, but the birthday before when I was had a broken ankle. That's what I bought her for her birthday because that's all I could afford. So I bought her that. And then for... Then, um... We had bubble tea. She had a um, lemonade with mango flavoring and strawberry bubbles or something like that. And I had um, green tea with strawberry flavoring and blueberry bubbles and they were really good that place was a little bit more than the place in the mall for bubble tea but it was but it was awesome
awesome because I wanted to buy her a bubble tea. And she got new, Grandma bought her new Crocs. And we had a, we had fun going there. Then we went to Walmart and Dollar Tree and I, that's where I got my mugs. And I bought, when I went to Walmart I got me some, uh, a new scrubby for washing myself because I needed one. And then I got those co coffee mugs and I bought Gracie the, char the charger and the phone cord. Because at Dollar Tree they got phone charging cords, but they don't have an iPhone one. They have the USB-C. And they got the micro USB. So they got them for Android, but they don't have them for, um, <clears throat> they don't have them for, um, iPhone. So I could get her one at Walmart. And then I got bought her this, um, coffee. Um, it's got coffee beans that spin around, and there's like a coffee cup, and it's got like brown liquid that's like coffee, and it's really freaking cute. I l thought it was cute, so I said to her, there's one if, one for your iPhone 6. I'll get it for you. So she found one, so I said I'd get it for her. So I got her that. Because I just wanted to get my niece something. Because I never can afford to buy her anything except for her birthday. So I got that. And I got approved to get, to get my back pay. And that's get through SSI. They give your back pay for my disability. Um, so that's going to be coming in a letter to tell me when I'm going to get it. So I'm going to start getting that sometime soon. Probably within 30 days. Which is very exciting for me. I'm so excited for that. And that will probably come on my next pay. That will come out of my... um. That's just going to be automatically deposited. So when I get that, I'm probably going to get a new desktop. I did get a new laptop recently with my social security, with um, the rest of my taxes because I knew I was getting social security so I knew I could start saving money. So I could start saving and keep the max that I'm allowed to keep in there. And keep the, I'm going to try to keep a minimum of $1,000 in my savings so that I'm not strapped for cash and then um, keep, and if I think, I'm going to re, I'm gonna do my budget once I figure out how much my bills are going to be. And if I can afford to have cable TV, I'm going to think I'm going to get, I don't know if I'm going to get cable TV, but I'm going to at least get internet. And I'm going to try to get unlimited internet. Because I really want that. So I can keep doing these videos for y'all. There's my, uh, there's my update for y'all. I'm going to get off here. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thanks for watching. Please make sure you go check out Dead Vision Entertainment. Because I'm going to be doing another video for them today. And what else? Don't forget to check out Joshua Danger's channel. He's going to be doing a new video on his channel. And um, I'm going to be doing a after the gathering um, um, video to highlight some of the things that I've seen. Or talk about the people that I know that went. And, um, talk about, um, my thoughts on why I would never go for my personal reasonings and my personal thoughts on why I wouldn't go. Not, not because I wouldn't want to hang out with all them people because that's the one reason I would go. But the reason, the personal reasons I wouldn't go. I'm going to talk about that on there, so... That being said, I'm going to get off here. Thanks for watching. Peace out. Much clown love to the Juggalo family. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Have a wonderful week and weekend, and I will see you in my next video. Love you all. Peace.